Hello and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to explain clustering example with Beach method in Python. The balanced iterative reducing and clustering using hierarchies is a hierarchical clustering algorithm, uh, and it provides a memory efficient clustering method for large datasets. Beach constructs uh, clustering features tree to represent the data in a compact manner. Each CF node contains information about subclusters, enabling the algorithm to process only necessary part of the data. In this tutorial, uh, I will briefly learn how to cluster data using the scikit-learn Birch class in Python. And here we cover the concept of Birch, preparing the data, clustering with Birch, and source code listing. Birch is a hierarchical clustering algorithm designed for the efficient processing of large datasets and it employs a clustering features tree, CFs, uh, a memory efficient hierarchical structure. The algorithm incrementally processes the data, creating nodes in the CF tree that represent subclusters or data points. Here are some key features of Birch method. Uh, this method utilizes clustering feature CF3, a hierarchical structure that condenses and organizes the data. Uh, CF3 allows memory efficient representation of the data. It helps for memory efficiency. And uh, balanced iterative reducing uh, that maintains a balance between three depths and the CF nodes to ensure efficiency. Threshold and uh, branching factor. It uses a threshold to control clusters formation and the branching factor to limit the number of subclusters. The method dynamically adjusts the tree uh, through splittings and merging as new data points are introduced. Now let's start uh, coding with this uh, model. We'll start by loading the required uh, modules. Here we use SQLR and cluster, datasets, uh, matplotlib, and numpy libraries. We create simple clustering data for this tutorial and visualize in a plot. Here is uh, the code how to generate synthetic data and uh, visualize it in a scatter plot. Here is uh, data to cluster. Scikit-learn provides a uh, Birch class, making it ac accessible for Python users. Parameters like the branching factor and the threshold can be adjusted based on the characteristics of the data set. First, we define the model using the bridge class and fit it to the X data. We set the branching factor and the threshold parameters. The branching factor determines the number of subclusters, while the threshold sets the limit between the samples and subclusters. You can also set the number of clusters to map uh, if it is none it will uh, attempt to find uh, optimal numbers. Here we define the Birch uh, model and uh, fit with X data. And uh, you can see the parameters of this model. Now we can predict X data and get the target cluster's ID. Then we visualize uh, output in a scatter plot. And here is the result. Uh, we clustered uh, our data into two into three clusters, so it's it's automatically automatically clustered. So the model uh, defined the number of clusters uh, three. That's it for this tutorial. In this tutorial, we briefly uh, learned how to cluster data with Birch method in Python. Birch is particularly useful for large datasets due to its memory efficient approach. And it offers an efficient and scalable solution for clustering large datasets. And it's often used in machine learning applications. The, so, uh, the complete source code is provided below. Here is the source code. Please visit my website uh, to get all the source codes and the information we have covered here. Please subscribe my channel and uh, hit the like button if you like this video. Thank you for watching and see you next time.